Okay. I'm doing a five-year plan for Kings Island. All speculation, or all prediction, and um, none of this has been announced. It's just all my guessing and thinking what they could be. This is one of my home parks. Um, so, let's begin. But well, let's um, look at the last five years, starting with 2012, to see what they've, what they've put in. For 2012, they added a water park expansion for Soak City. For 2013, they added a new show called Rock and Roller Coaster, or Rock and Roll Never Forgets show. In 2014, they added Banshee, the, long, the world's longest invert. 2015, they added a Planet Snoopy expansion, at the world, uh, Midwest's largest Starbucks, and a petting zoo. In 2016, they added Tropical Plunge as a water park expansion. And this year, they're adding Mystic Timbers, a GCI wooden roller coaster that I will be experiencing this April. Okay, beginning with 2018. I predict a Planet Snoopy expansion. I'm predicting this because after Banshee they um, expanded the kids area and this would be three or so years after that expansion since it's been only three years since Mystic, T Mystic Timbers and Banshee. Okay. For two, 2019, I'm predicting just overall park park improvements, like um, adding more um, stuff to their um, gar or flower beds and sprucing up the park. No, no, no real big changes. Maybe add a show, add a new haunted house, just spruce up the place. Okay, for 2020. A lot of people are going to be surprised with this prediction, but since this would be 15 years since the Backlot Stunt Coaster was opened, and my understanding, not a lot of people like this roller coaster. It's, I mean, it gets quite a long line sometimes, but I, I personally don't believe that it's that big of a deal if they take it out. It's what was left over from Paramount Studios. I also predict them to. Um, take out Dinosaurs Alive. So that would be two attractions and one year closed. Plus I'm predicting them to add some flat rides as well. Like one of those two in the picture. Okay. In 2021, I'm predicting that's when they'll get their next roller coaster. A B&M Hyper, or a B&M Giga, or an Intamin Giga. One of those two, I'm predicting it to be over 345 feet. Be one of the longest in America or in the world. One of the two works. But I'm predicting it to be a huge, um, huge, huge budget. For 2020, I'm predicting them just to um, do a Soak City expansion. With 2023 and 2022, I, these could go either way, but I'm predicting a Soak City expansion for 2022. For 23, just overall park exp um, improvements, add a show, um, or expand Planet Snoopy. Either one of these two could actually go either way. I could see it happening. Okay, thank you for watching. If you have any questions, especially for the closure of the Backlot and Stunt Coaster, um, why I'm predicting not to close, just leave a comment down below and have a good day.